Well, if you haven't done it already, grab your pumpkins and bring them inside. Tonight's expected to be a widespread freeze across the region. WCCO's Kirsten Mitchell went to the experts at Mother Earth Gardens in Minneapolis and has some tips to protect your garden and your yard during the changing temps. This is full of pumpkins, lots and lots of pumpkins in here. At Mother Earth Gardens in Northeast Minneapolis. That's what we're doing, is protecting everything as much as we can. The pumpkins and plants are layering up ahead of the big freeze. Pumpkins people should bring inside. Yeah. It is really the right thing to do if you happen to have carved them already in particular. Marsha Frey suggests protecting mums, especially if they're unplanted, like the ones Brianna Clymer picked up Sunday. I'm not the biggest screen thumb, so I always like to take their advice here. They're great. Yeah. Um, so yeah, they'll come inside with us for a couple days. The freeze won't impact all plants, though. Kale will do okay. Some herbs are going to do just fine. The parsley does fine. A lot of the perennial herbs are going to be fine. This time of year, your yard probably looks a lot like this. You'll want to get the raking done before the first snowfall, otherwise it could lead to mold in the spring. But experts say it's a good idea to leave some leaves behind and use it as mulch. I normally just mulch them up and let them just sit on the grass um, over the winter. The more that you can use leaves as mulch is a really great thing. But Marcia says before you spread that mulch, water, 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 water. Just wait until next weekend when it's warmer. The slow, deep water of all the trees and the shrubs and your perennials would be a really good gift. Tips to protect your plants so you don't wake up in the morning with an expression like this. In Minneapolis, Kirsten Mitchell, WCCO 4 News. Hey, don't want to look like that. You can use many different things to cover your plants, including sheets, towels, tarps, or place a basket or container on top of them.